<clears throat> what is up guys dash here for episode 93 of community universe mode we are here live at payback kicking off the king of the ring for the guys zach page gonna be going up first here in this first round matchup again we don't know who his opponent will be I'm probably gonna, I might, might not be as, uh, you know, hyped as you guys. I'm super tired today. I was moving uh, to my new house and stuff, putting some new stuff up, so I've been about all day, so I'm kind of a little bit tired, but I'm gonna be as hyped as possible for this awesome paper you have lined up. What's up, boy? I'm hyped for this King of the Ring tournament, though. Zach Cage, guys, gonna be kicking things off here in a payback. Who's his opponent gonna be? We're going to figure out who the mystery man is right now. Wait a minute, guys. Who is this? Wait a minute. From Scotland. Scott. It's Scott Nori! It's Scott Nori! Scott Nori returning here tonight, guys, at Payback in the King of the Ring tournament. We haven't seen this man since WrestleMania, where he lost to The Miz. But Nori makes his return here tonight at Payback. He's going to be taking on Zach Cage in a first round matchup and the 2016 King of the Ring Tournament. Scott Nori is back, ladies and gentlemen. He's got a new look about him. What a night this would be for Scott Nori if he could win the King of the Ring Tournament on his return. This is not only our first matchup of the night, ladies and gentlemen. This is our first round matchup in the King of the Ring tournament. Of course, there's four first round matches, then two semifinal matches, then, this, then the uh, finals, of course. The winner will go on later tonight to get their world title match against Duel Maxwell. Remember, because of course, Cyborg refused to sign his uh, contract for his title match against Duo tonight, so Triple H took matters into his own hands and announced that the winner of the tournament won't have to wait very long to get their title match. Later on tonight in the main event, <coughs> Duo will put his title up for grabs against the winner of the tournament. I can't believe Scott Norrie's back. <sighs> Cage doesn't seem too phased about this though. He's going right after Nori. Back to the collar and elbow. Nori's sporting a new look about him, and I like it. No nonsense. Not that Nori has ever been, you know, one of, oh, the fans don't like it. The fans don't like the collar and elbow game. The Universe Mode uh, fans, they don't like it. Nori with a nice smell and drop off the pullback attack. The fans like that. Nori definitely looking no nonsense here tonight. Again, we haven't seen this man in two months since WrestleMania where he lost to The Miz in that number one contenders match. I guess Nori took it pretty hard. Took a couple months off. Maybe tried to, he, he was on a long losing streak before he left. WrestleMania really just capped it off. Maybe he took some time off, you know, trained harder. Got himself in better shape. He definitely looks in better shape. Looking a little bit more muscular than usual. <laughs> what a night it would be for Scott Norris if he could win King of the Ring and then go on to challenge Duo for the undisputed world title, ladies and gentlemen. This is our first matchup of the night. Got so much action to get to, even besides the King of the Ring tournament. Hardcore title on the line, tag titles on the line, U.S. title on the line. And there are rumors, ladies and gentlemen, that we're actually going to have a bonus match here tonight. Apparently... We're going to see a new superstar. I'm getting reports from backstage that there's an unknown man walking around. Apparently, he's 
asking for a matchup, so maybe we're gonna see another match here tonight. I don't know what this is all about. We'll just have to wait and see. Right now, Nori and Cage starting things off pretty slow here. Nori with a nice belly to belly off the pullback attack reversal. <sighs> Again, this is the King of the Rings tournament. Every man will have to compete. Well, if he wins, he'll have to compete more than once tonight, so you don't want to wear yourself out too fast in, in the first round matchups. Nori and Cage got to be careful of that. They don't want to go into the semifinals worn down already. <clears throat> Rick of the eyes from Cage. Hard Irish whip into the turnbuckle now. Now Cage is stomping away at Nori here. Pull for another Irish whip. Looks for the pullback attack. Nori says no way. <laughs> WWE doesn't uh, doesn't interfere in our universe trouble. So let's just pretend that Hogan uh, never said any of those things here in the Come Universe universe. All right, please chill. What's Cage going for here? Irish whip follows up the crossbody. Cage going to follow it up with some heavy shots right to the face. Nori, I still can't get over the fact that Scott Nori is returning here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. And the King of the Rings tournament. We haven't seen him in two months. Cage, though, putting up one hell of a fight. He's not going to lay down for the returning Nori. Nori wouldn't want that any anyway. Nori wants a hard-fought battle here. That's what he's getting. Cage goes for a drop kick. Nori sidesteps it though. Running forearm smash. One of these guys has got to be closing in on a signature pretty soon. They've been going at it for a good while now. First round matchup in the King of the Ring tournament. Scott Nori returning to take on Zach Cage. And Cage with the brain buster. Down onto the knee. Thank you, Cage. Wait a minute, guys. Cage, where did Cage get a finisher? Where the hell did Cage get a finisher? Common courtesy. Common courtesy, my God. Cage hooks the leg. One, two, three. No, no, Scott Nori kicks out. Where the hell did he get a finisher? Where in the hell did Zach Cage get a finisher, guys? That's what I want to know. Luckily, Nori was able to kick out. But wait a minute, Cage go over the mission Oko driver. Nori counters into a single knee backbreaker. Nori's got to be careful here, guys. He can't take another common courtesy. And Cage now going for his comeback roll up from Nori, though. Oh, Nori almost got it off the schoolboy. Did he counter Nori Sig? I didn't see that. Cage pulling out these fins from midair. Please chill. I'm pretty sure Scott Nori has a signature now because he reversed Zach Cage's Mr. Noku driver. Nori better be quick trying to hit that. He doesn't want Cage to get another finisher. I don't think Nori will be able to kick out of two. Oh, Nori, do not waste your finisher. Oh, Nori, gonna waste his finisher looking for a suicide dive. Nori sizing Cage up, rebounds off the ropes. Through the middle rope, guys. Suicide dive. Nori's kicking Peyton back off with a bang here, folks. Kind of wasting his finisher, but that was awesome. Maybe he can pin Cage here. He can get back in the ring in time and pin Cage. Oh, no, Cage getting back to his feet. That wasn't very smart from Nori. Definitely giving the fans uh, what they paid for here, some excitement, but he wasted the finisher in doing that. Now Cage can take this opportunity to try to get back on top, try to get another finisher. I still can't believe Nori kicked out of that first common courtesy. Pull back attack right into the elbow. <laughs> and Cage, guys, Cage with the senton across the ribs, but Nori not gonna sell it. Looking for his comeback. One punch to the head, two punches to the head. Gonna go for that Irish whip now, but Cage reverses. Nori rebounds off the ropes. Knee right to the jaw, can Nori capitalize? What is Nori doing? Going for the pin. All right, I don't know what he's doing. One, two. Oh, he almost got it. Very close there.
I'm pretty sure uh, Cage has another finisher, guys. Nori now has a signature. Oh, no, Nori has a finisher. Guys, Scott, Nori stalking Cage. Can Nori do it? Can Nori hit the gym? No, wait a minute. Koji Clutch. Koji Clutch. Will Cage tap? Will Cage tap? Will Cage tap to the Koji Clutch? Yes, he does. Zach Cage submits to the Koji Clutch, ladies and gentlemen, and Scott Nori advances. What a way to kick off payback here. Very back and forth matchup. As Zach Cage is forced to submit to the Koji Clutch here. <laughs> Please chill, Chris. You notice had the the Koji Clutch since NXT. What a way to kick off payback here. Scott Nori returning to Kim Universe to take down Zach Cage in advance to the semifinals. <laughs> Nori didn't even hit his signature. I don't know how he got his finisher. He didn't even hit a six, so I don't know. That was weird. Maybe he went right away to the, the bid. Scott Nori returning here tonight, guys, at Payback after a two-month absence. Advancing to the semifinals after a great matchup here, forcing Zach Cage to submit. <sighs> now the next matchup, I believe, is just insane Jeremy Blake. All right, it takes us back. I forgot that. So next up is just insane Jeremy Blake if the game will load. What is happening? What the heck? Error roster? 2K, please. What is going on 